Hello, I am Argama Witch. And have you ever tried to export your model with teeth and they did not work? Well, I have a blend shape video that will help you, but apparently people stop watching after that point. So this one is going to just kind of explain just that point. So what you're going to need to do is import your model into Unity. And you can do that by getting this UniVRM. I use UniVRM.53.0. Uh, and basically you just click on it, import your model, and then you import it. We're going to add some TTs to our gamma. So we're going to go drop her into the hierarchy, which I guess you don't really need to do, but we're going to do it anyways. And then we're going to go find her file over here and open the blend shapes. When you click on it, you can see her over here. Look at this. Look at, look at the beautiful face. And when you go, ah! There's no fangs. Where are the fangs? Well, what you do is you drop down this menu and you just turn on your fangs, whether they're the shark fangs or the vampire cat fangs, whatever. And you just do that. You take the one you want and you slide it all the way up. Now you're going to do this for every one, even if the mouth is closed. You're going to do all of them. And the reason you're going to do them for all of them is because if you're in the middle of doing an A and then jump to an O, or if you're in the middle of like, let's say the the I, the E, E, and you go to an O sound, it, they're just gonna like suddenly um, slide into place and it's gonna look really weird, like retractable teeth. And you, you're not gonna want that. So just go one by one and adjust these fangs and just slowly turn them on. Every single one. Don't be lazy. Turn them all on. I know, it's easy to be lazy. Like, not finish the video that had the actual tutorial on this. But that's fine. I made another one just for you. Uh, I do it for the blanks, too. I don't think you really need to, but, you know, I like to be extra. Also, it's just a few extra seconds to do this. And it ensures that you don't have any, like, weirdness afterwards. Yeah. And so you keep doing that throughout the whole thing. And then when you're done, you'll select your character here on the hierarchy and go back over to this VRM and then you're going to want to do export humanoid a window like this will appear you want to make sure all this stuff's filled out which you should have if you exported it or at least if you follow any of my tutorials and then you're going to export it and you should be all set and now your character will have those shark teeth or vampire teeth or cat teeth or just teeth your character will have sharp pointy ass teeth so it can bite through things yep that's pretty much it I hope this tutorial has helped you I know it's kind of a repeat tutorial for those who have actually watched my other one, but you know. Anyways, I know these tutorials seem kind of passive aggressive lately, but I honestly don't know what to make tutorials on anymore because I feel like I've already touched on all this stuff in one video or another and I'm just repeating myself. But here you are. And here I am. Okay, goodbye.